So we have a little bit of a toilet issue in our RV toilet. A while back we noticed a little bit of leakage coming from the back. Water leakage. Water leakage, yeah. Let's, wa clarify. let's clarify that first. It's, it's just water dripping every time you would flush the toilet. We bought a replacement kit a few weeks ago and we're here home for the holidays and we have some extra time so we're going to do some projects. Our first project on the list is fix the toilet. So what we have is a Thetford residential high-rise RV toilet. It has a foot pedal flush. You cannot see there is a water pump apparatus uh, back here that will pull in water from the city or fresh water and then it will spread it in the spreader to actually flush down here in the toilet. We think what the problem is there's probably a seal or something in this water pump that has sprung a leak. I think it's somewhat of a common issue so we went to an RV repair shop or an RV sales shop and they have kits that comes with all the parts it includes it's basically a whole fixer upper kit for like sixty dollars and it comes with a new water pump it comes with new hoses and clamps you also have um, a plastic foam gasket seal underneath this tower which we'll take off that will replace so we're basically going to be replacing a lot of parts so let's see if i can get some of the leakage on camera just to show you what's happening so here's our water line that comes into the back, which will disconnect, but let me see if I can get some water dripping. There. Yeah. So, and we can't see it because it's at a terrible angle. We've used some mirrors and we think we think it's the water pump, but like I said, it doesn't matter because the repair kit that you get for this specific toilet just kind of comes with everything. So here's the plan. We're going to disconnect the city water. We're going to try to drain as much water that's already in the lines out. And then we're going to disconnect. There's two bolts down here at the base of the toilet. The other one is right under there focus there it is and that actually is what's holding the toilet down to the floor we're gonna remove the toilet i'm gonna carry it outside so i have room to work with and shannon's gonna cover this hole because once you take this toilet off that's a straight shot about four inch hole straight down into your black tank which might stink don't know haven't done it so we're gonna cover that up so that it doesn't just release some toxic fumes in here. <laughs> and then we're gonna go work outside. So let me grab my tools and we'll start removing this whole thing.
we got our little setup here. We've got our trash bag, our towels, which are old cut up rags. We've got some tools back here. And I think we're ready to disassemble this bad boy. We're gonna finish draining. You can still see there's water in the bowl. We'll get all that out. We're gonna make sure there's no more water in the line. I've sanitized everything, but we're still wearing gloves because no one wants to mess with poopy hands. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, we've got our toilet stopper. So this is a roll of toilet paper in a couple grocery bags that once that, once we, I lift the toilet up, I'm running outside and Shannon's gonna plug the hole with this to keep the stinky out. All right, so let's get the water draining and looks empty to me. We're gonna disconnect the water first. These are cut up t-shirts. So I'm assuming it's still gonna leak some. We drained all the water as much as we could, um, but it's probably still gonna leak some. So I'm gonna throw some shirts down back here just in case. So here's, Sorry, I'm gonna bang the camera. Right. Our main water source right here. It should just unscrew, so I'm probably gonna get in the way. Here we go. Okay, not too bad. So now we're disconnected. And the only thing holding this toilet is these bolts so half inch socket these little plastic things pop right off okay and I'll do the other side pop that off Okay, so now, in theory, this should pop right off. Yep. Okay, so now I'm going to lift it off. We've got the bolts off. I'm gonna lift it off, set it in this trash bag, and then kind of carry it all outside. And then Shan's gonna plug the hole, but I'm curious to see what it looks like. So, here we go. That was way easier than it was supposed to be. So now I've got the toilet disconnected and let's go outside. Here, I'll get the door. Okay. Okay, so we have the toilet out and if you wanna come in a little closer, so we have our, our main water line here. That's where the city water or your fresh water tank, the main water intake uh, is hooked up. And this is our water pump assembly thingy-majig that we're gonna replace. So I have a kit. And let's see. All right, so we didn't know the actual parts uh, when we went shopping for this and if you remember it's way back in the corner so you can't really get a picture of it so uh, we got lucky and I was just searching for different pumps and, and found one that I thought looked like it and it looks like the perfect one so I think all we're gonna have to do is redo these hoses with clamps get this hooked back up and then uh, this is a new, I guess, floor gasket that the toilet will sit on that will do that last before we reinstall it. So I actually need to go grab my pliers. 
so I can undo these. But your job is to remember how it's hooked up. I think it'll be pretty easy. So let me go grab my pliers real quick. Why don't you just grab them? Yeah. No smell, that's working like a charm. So we're gonna get comfortable and start taking these hoses off. I think it's my splash. Nice. Okay. Look out. So here's the old assembly. And it looks like the top, we think that's where it was leaking out of. Here's the new one. Interesting. Hmm. Hopefully this was the source of the leak. Yeah. Teamwork. This one's gonna be hard. There we go. Nice. You're right, I need your pliers. That's it. Few pumps installed. Here's the old one. Nice. Perfect. New one. Very good, baby. Nice work. So we just finished the installing the new water pump assembly and now um, 
we got to replace the closet flange, uh, which is basically the O-ring that sits on the bottom of this toilet. So I'm gonna pull the old one off. Oh yeah. So here's the old one. Here's the new one, lip side down. We'll get it up there nice and snug. Oh wow, yeah. Nice and tight? Nice and tight. Perfect. Compared to the other old one. Okay. Cool now the easy part. Reinstall it. Hi, Super. <clears throat> okay, so now we'll um, remove the plug and then I'm just going to set the toilet back on the, the bolts, the two bolts on the bottom and we'll try to get it tightened down. Okay. Ready? I'm ready. You need me to hold one side up? No. Oh. Okay. So that new seal. The new seal. It'll be a little wobbly until I think we get these nuts on. Perfect, yeah. Okay, I'll do this side first. Do we need to press that seal up more? Uh, they said it no, would be they like said that. it. It would reseat itself yeah. as we sit on it with our fat butts. Yeah. Okay. And let me get the other one started. All right. Okay, get it just semi tight. Let me. I'll do the same thing on the other side. You can already see it starting to reseat itself. Pretty solid. So, uh, last step is just connect the water back up. A little bit of water leakage. Get it nice and snug. Okay, I'll replace the little bolt covers. That makes it look so fancy. <laughs> Ooh, gorgeous. And let's go turn the water back on and we'll give it a test. Sound good? Sounds good. All right, so I'm gonna throw a couple more towels back there in case the problem is worse <laughs> and let's give it a shot if it works let's see if it leaks do you want to show it getting water in there Ooh, it looks like it works better so nice and spread let's see if we can get some drippage so full flush Halfway press, stop. Halfway press, stop. Halfway press. I feel like it would have done it. Do it two more times. I feel like we had to do it five. I'm not seeing anything. No leaking. Job well done. We fixed it for now. Woo! Good job. Good job. Go team. We were not looking forward to this fix, but it wasn't as bad as we expected. It was the hardest part were those dang clamps. <laughs> Shooting them off. Yeah. Whoa. Oh. 
but awesome got a new seal on the bottom cleaned everything a new pump that should last a couple of years awesome job go team yeah, go team that's how you fix the toilet okay. oh, just cheers. cheers like and subscribe damn it. <laughs> don't say damn it you can still use it okay.